I beg of you to defog. Come on, Jack. I know you want to. Real men defogs. Yes. <laughs> oh, Majin Buu, get the competitive boost. So I got the chance to battle some noob here on YouTube. I have no idea who this guy is. And, uh... Freaking me while you really... <laughs> he brought the <this> stuff. <laughs> so Jack, good luck, have fun. Um, I'm bringing Defla team that I think is going to struggle here. Um, I always try to bring something a bit more unique, and this time I feel like overdoing it. And uh, well, clearly this is the helping. So Plumpy is the lead of choice. And um, well, I'll just go directly for an earthquake. I really just need to hurt this guy, even though Covenite is such an easy switch in. Yeah, nothing to it. Um, Dame Silvera. That was about right. Shiny too. And pressure. Nice. So... The way I see it, I can definitely switch this guy in. Um, I am a bit worried about Braybird. And there is really nothing that my pom pom <laughs> can do here. A lot of months here, it just stops and down on its track. But hopefully, we can do something with this. Defogging. I don't know why I did that. Um, it's maybe a bit too aggressive to go for a quiver dance when you have a Jolty on a team. Um, I'll do that anyway. See what he wants to do. Keeps defogging. What for? He's baiting me for shit, right? That Jolteon is so coming in. What are you cooking, Jack? Like, I, I am pretty sure he baits me badly. Plumpy comes in again. Right, quiver again. Because he can just go for mad hasses if it so desires. Let's see. Stealth rocks, yeah, looks about right. Because Clotzar has two options in my book. He can Earthquake and he can Toxic Me. I think either way is fine. Uh, but I think Air Slash should absolutely do nothing. There's a shit mon. <laughs> of course. <laughs> huh, I really thought it would do damage. That's bad. I'm at plus two. What the hell is going on here? That was not good. <coughs> Did not expect that. <laughs> huh. Maybe the pom pom really is awful. It might. That just might be it, right? Huh. Look, I'm. I'm certainly surprised about this. I need to recheck that mod later. At plus two, clothes are just la Oh, it's unaware. That's why. That's fucking why. I'm being dumb. <laughs> I might be a bit too oblivious here, but that, of course, it's unaware. Right, getting my rocks up. <clears throat> His only real offensive move towards me is, um, all things considered, um, Earthquake, which he might feel obliged to use. All of a sudden, like, Clotzar became very hard for me to deal with. I totally forgot about the Unaware. 
Right, let's see what he decides to do. Goes directly for the earthquake. Nothing to it. That was a crit. I was like, damn. For being somewhat defensive, it did a lot. Right, I'm rapid spinning here. Does decide to withdraw. That's fair enough. Two. The Corviknights, yeah. Good play, mate. Good play. So I'm not particularly fond that our only like real responses here are defensive ones who definitely need to kick things off with some Rocky Helmet damage, right? Wanna see Rocky Helmet? Yeah, there we go. A lot of stuff. Hmm. Come on, Jack, be offensive. Honestly, though, if his Clodsar is where it is, I probably can't beat it with this team, actually. I beg of you to defog. Come on, Jack, I know you want to. Real men defogs. Yes. <laughs> oh, Majin Buu, get the competitive boost. That's what's up, man. That's what's up. I'll just go for a fire blast. <laughs> I mean, Cloudstar probably comes in again. Um, a wit unaware, it's definitely annoying enough to deal with. Please do damage. Nothing. I can't break this guy. I simply cannot. I can't offensively go like goblin mode on it, though. I kind of need to break it. I need a crit. Badly. Oh, fuck me. This is not good. I need soften. Like a freeze would be nice. Or a crit. Anything. <laughs> I'm just bringing too weak of a team here to really kick him off. That's a freaking shame, too. Freeze him, crit him, whatever. Oh, shit. Do I have really anything to beat him with? I really have not. I am absolutely defeated by this set. Come on. A freeze would be so nice. I never thought I'd say it, but Claude Sire actually turns out to be quite the, <laughs> quite the mod to deal with. And there is nothing I can do. There is simply nothing I can do. Bad design to a point, sure. But still. This is not good. This is simply not good. I can't have it. Some part of me want a fire blast though. Huh. I'm just like really thinking, is there anything I really in theory could have done to really stop this thing? It's it's just too much for me. <laughs> for all the wrong reasons, right? Alright. What does this guy want to do? He can pretty much do whatever he wants. Armor Cannon, just take me out. <laughs> Alright. Hmm.
All right, let's see. Knock off, easy play. Should also hurt the Dame Silvera, right? Yeah. <laughs> That's what we want. Get the Rocky Helmet out of the way, it's going to be very helpful. Hmm. I'm just really thinking. Like, what in theory can I do? Against any of this. We're like half the game in. And I'm just thinking, no matter what offensive means I make, I'm still screwed by the Cloud Sire. <laughs> That's a very strange scenario to be in. Alright. Go for a Raging Bull. I know we got switch-ins for it, but this time it doesn't matter. I'm getting freaking beaten to a busted hell here. So I think in theory my best play no matter what here is to pretty much make sure just to not get 6-0'd. I think that's going to be my goal for this game. Everything else couldn't care less. I can't care less. <laughs> Let's see, brings in Reptilius. That's a name. Oh yeah, this guy. Nice. So Willow this. Yeah, Shed Tail, of course. And I Willow Wisp. Nicely done, Chris. That ought to do it. <laughs> I was thinking body press, I swear. <clears throat> yeah, not my strongest game. Not at all. Oh, Jolteon. Here we go. Behind us up. Everything comes together. So he's probably called mine, right? Thunderbolt. Looks about right. It's gonna hurt. Ooh, he sure as hell did. Do I even have a response for this? I mean, I do. I don't wanna really sack this just yet, right? It's just, once Clodsar comes back in, it is back to square one. <laughs> Come on, Kung Lao, let's do this. Thunderbolt, nothing to it. And, uh, yeah, Ice Seed Bomb here. Clodsar should be the response. It's gonna get a nice neutral hit. Dame Silvera, alright, fair enough. Four times resistance, you'll thought about that. I am not playing very well right now. I'm like, can I even like create an opening for myself or or, or I'm or am I just beaten? Please roost. I outspeed him. Of course I do. <laughs> How is that possible? <laughs> Defogging, fair enough. No hazards for either of us. And um well, he could lose to Corviknight right now, that would be nice. Go for a crunch. <laughs> yes! Not 6 0 That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> the small victories. Shillerin, yeah. Isn't this the GG? Got a bit. Ah, 
I mean, all things considered, what could I have done? All right, Bashteiner. We can only hope he's scarfed, right? I am so screwed. <laughs> oh, I'm so fucking screwed. <laughs> Here we go. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Like I said, I'm... <clears throat> Maybe I should could have put up some stops at the start, but I knew from the matchup I had nothing for it, and combined that with, well, the unaware quag and I got nothing. I really got nothing. So I definitely need to go and reconsider this team. I'm clearly not having the means to pull this off. So with that in mind, like all the power to Jack here, I, I got nothing. I absolutely got nothing even my defensive Tauros doesn't have intimidate so that's bad that was real bad so if I upload this it's just a showcase I fought him and I had absolute awfulness team against <laughs> whatever he brought um, but yeah I mean that said more power to, to Jack he definitely pulled all the stops and thank you for well take your time to battle me Hopefully I can do something better next time. That's it guys, as always, thank you for watching. Don't forget to watch Jack's side of the battle, and I'll see you all in the next video. Until then, take care.